Ma'am? It's not nitrous oxide. That's propane. Well, if it's propane, it's murder. Well, I need to confirm, of course. Yeah, that's what it smells like. Sorry, B.T. Cerrone, lead investigator. B.T. As in Brandon Thomas. Though everyone seems to think it's for bomb tech. Mm, nice oven bits. Thank you. They cheer me up. 205 degrees Celsius. Oh, somebody overcooked the Thanksgiving turkey. Nothing too exciting over there. Uh, I'll eventually get all the shrapnel. It's concentrated in the posterior regions of the shoulder, neck, and head, but he's still too hot. Speaking of too hot, where's BT? BT who? Funny. Actually, since your last boyfriend was Dennis the serial killer, I'm all for BT. <sighs> Do you think there are any fingers left in these gloves? Like, I would love some prints. What, we got another body coming in? In a manner of speaking, we're doing the vehicle autopsy here. In the morgue? In here? You can't do that? Well, of course I can, as part of my office. And BT wants to be in close proximity to the crime lab in order to facilitate his examination of the car. Or his examination of the medical examiner. I don't know what you're talking about. Come here. What are you doing? I'm taking your temperature. It's a subtle sign of sexual arousal. He's a very nice man. He has a PhD in applied physics, and he practices yoga. Yeah, and why would you like that, a yogi with a PhD? Ew. He's so hideous to look at, too. I said he was nice. OK. Can you find some fingers in there, please? Because I really need an ID.